Hello, my YouTube foodie family members. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we are going to fry the perfect fish, the best fish, tastiest to the bones. All right, family, let's dive right into this recipe. And today, I am going to be frying croaker fish. Yes. So these are my ingredients and I got some spices there. I'll drop a list of them in the description box. I'm going to blend the scotch bonnet pepper, garlic, ginger, some serrally leaves, and then I am going to season. My fish has been washed thoroughly with some lime, salt, water. I've deboned <laughs> what needs to be boned, removed the scales and everything, and they've been cut neatly just like this, okay? You don't want to cut them to be too chunky because you want the flavors to get right into it. So I'm going to mix the dry ingredients and the wet marinade together, and we will go ahead and marinate our fish. So now we want to gently mix this up. So I'm just going to swirl this around gently in the bowl so that it's fish and it needs to be handled delicately. Okay. <laughs> fish looks like you can keep that aside for two hours overnight even better but i fried mine right away so i got some oil on fire you don't want to add too much just a little the fish shouldn't cover the fish that's the secret to get this crispy perfect juicy and tender and flavorful fish Oh my, my kitchen is smelling so, so good at this point. This is just the perfect marinade for the fish. You will absolutely love it. After frying for about four minutes on one side, I like to flip it again. I'll fry for another four minutes and flip it for six minutes and flip it again. All in all, it should be about 12 minutes to get this fish to the perfect crispy yet juicy and tender consistency that I want. Okay. My goodness, look at how beautiful it's looking already. If you're new to my channel, a very warm welcome to you. Please consider being a part of the family by hitting on the subscribe button and the notification okay. bell because at Jerry Present Fusion, you will never run out of ideas in your kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> Recipe without others is what we bring on here. To my OGs, thank you so much for watching. This fish is perfect to be served at parties where you don't want to use it in stews. You can serve it with jollof rice, fried rice. You can snack on it. Yeah, a healthy, perfect snack for you. So our fish is ready and we're going to take that out and just serve and enjoy. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned a thing or two. It's that easy, it's that simple. See you in my next video. Bye!